Here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. First off, Chelsea, I'm joining you. I'm not going in the water with that shark nearby, but luckily it wasn't too bad of a beach day all across the area. Cloudy skies, warm conditions. Most of the rain that we saw was actually for northern Rhode Island in the form of light showers. Nothing like we saw yesterday with that severe weather. So that's some good news. Here's a live look outside. You can see this is the capital city of Providence. And again, cloudy skies, some fog. That's the theme for tonight as well. And some passing showers too. Again, nothing on the heavy side, but some lighter showers are certainly possible right through tonight into tomorrow morning. Temperatures near Providence, low 80s, dew points still on the tropical side and muggy side, 73. Another live look here is Newport. Notice the fog. You can see cloudy skies and some fog in developing, and this is going to be continuing as we go through tonight. And current temperatures in Newport, mid 70s, 76 dew points as uh, low 70s and still tropical as well. So live radar, well, a lot quieter. You can see the light showers in uh, North Providence County. You can see they kind of fizzled on out and they're very light in nature for this afternoon. Nothing really crazy going on and we're staying dry for now and more pop up showers coming in for later on tonight through your Monday. But again, not a washout temperatures right now. A wide range where it was raining earlier today in Smithfield 71 degrees. Providence 82 a warm spot on the map and then down in Newport again 76 out in New Bedford 78. So not too bad out there. Just cloudy skies and some fog as well. Satellite and radar. Most of the heavier rain is off to the north and west in upstate New York and also western Massachusetts. So we are dry for now. Let's time things out for you though from tonight through tomorrow morning. Scattered showers here 7 p.m. Temperatures in the 60s and 70s. And then as we go into tonight, cloudy skies continue. Watch out for patchy fog as well. And we have a little bit of a dry spell, but again, pop up showers possible. Notice the green blips on the map. Those are those scattered showers moving on by for tomorrow morning. So it could be a wet start to your commute. And by the afternoon, here's noontime. Again, scattered showers continuing, but it's not an all day washout. They're very scattered and light. Nothing too, that, uh, too bad that we can't handle. And by the afternoon, notice the clearing in uh, eastern Connecticut and western parts of the state. That is some sunshine that looks to be coming through for tomorrow afternoon into tomorrow evening. So ending the day on a drier note, that's for sure. Temperatures in the 60, 60s and 70s by tomorrow night. Clear skies taking over and Tuesday. It looks to be pretty nice. But for tonight's forecast, mostly cloudy. Chance of a shower, patchy fog as well. Notice the precip percentages, only 30%. Temperatures dropping back into the upper 60s. Now for tomorrow morning, Monday, mostly cloudy skies again. Spot showers right through lunchtime. Again, 30% chance. Temperatures getting into the upper 60s to near 70 for the afternoon. And beach forecast, sky conditions, scattered showers, temperatures in the low 70s, low rip current risk as well. Waves three to four feet. Bay forecast, similar story, scattered showers, cloudy skies, even some fog at times. Better later in the day. And then uh, watch out for uh, visibility with the fog and showers as well. Seven day forecast looking pretty good on Tuesday after those showers on Monday. Lots of sunshine, temperatures in the mid 80s. Another round of showers and storms coming in for Wednesday, nice and dry on Thursday. And as always, you can turn to WPR.com for your latest forecast update.